Welcome to Homesteady As I Go. I'm Teresa. So today I thought I'd give us an update of the garden. I haven't shown the garden for a while. Um, it is stifling. It is so hot. It is just stifling uh, here today. It is, uh, whew, it's actually bearable right now, but it was not. It was just horrible <laughs> we did a lot of workout this morning um you know uh lawn that type of thing um we had stuff to add to a burn pile uh our issues lately gosh i've been having some issues today my poor chickens over here they're traumatized i'm surprised they're still giving me eggs i've had to get two snakes out of there within two days um we didn't see them before, so I don't know how long they were there. Um, let's go ahead and let's take a look at the garden. So, here is my garden. Um, these are all my tomato plants. These are going to be Roma's. This is Roma's. These are beefsteak tomatoes. I know my steaks are crooked. Just bear with me. Um, these are my beefsteak tomatoes. And I'm getting some good tomatoes from them, right? Not too bad. I have a little more of Romas that are coming in. Um, but I'm learning. This is my first time I've ever planted um, a garden like that, you know? Um, and I, I'm so pleased with it. I'm pleased with what I've gotten from it. I'm learning as I go. Um... I've learned that I need to cut the sucker things off. I need to cut the suckers off <laughs> of your tomato plants when they're growing, but I didn't quite do all that, but that's okay. Uh, so uh, I also have some peppers that are coming in. I'm pretty proud of these. I don't know what these little bugs are that are on my plant. Get off. <laughs> um, those look pretty good, but I only got a couple. Like I said, it's my first year. Not perfect, but okay. Um, my onions are doing really good. My carrots, I don't know how the carrots are going to come in. They should be maturing soon, but I don't see, we haven't seen anything really come out of them yet, so we're waiting. Um, my daughter planted some watermelon, and do you see this little teeny baby watermelon plant? <laughs> So she's got uh, her watermelon plants trying to flower out. Um, carrots. This is butternut squash. Don't know how that's going to go. Um, I'm not going to trellis these. They really do have a lot of room to, to grow. So I'm going to just let them go. Um, I tried planting late. Live and you learn. You live and you learn. Um, I don't know if you can see this. These. My tomatillo plants. I planted. They came up, they died. So I don't, I thought I could try a second planting. That's not working. My dill, I've got one little piece of dill coming up. Pickles are doing pretty good. Well, not pickles, but cucumbers. My cucumbers are doing pretty good. And I got some good sized cucumbers in there. Um, try planting some late spinach. Not one came up. Lettuce, working on coming up. Had bad fungus on my plants, trimmed them back really well. Uh, here on my squash plants, I've got new growth up here. Got my fingers crossed. Uh, what I learned about those, I'm not going to plant two variety of squash close together because I really think they were cross pollinating and having some trouble. But my piece of resistance, my pride and joy, is my spaghetti squash plant. That I did right. We're getting a ton of rain. Um, the leaves are starting to die back. I can't even keep up with all of trimming all those dead leaves back because I can't reach them all. So I don't know if you can see all of my spaghetti squash. I have female flowers up top. You see them up top? I can't reach those to help pollinate them. So I'm really hoping that the bees and ants um, We'll get to them because I can't even begin to reach them up there to try and help pollinate those. Um, but these are my spaghetti squash. Look at this. Look at that. 
that's pretty good I got a bunch of baby ones in through here you see this one here there's some other ones in the background I got another big one over there so I'm pleased I still have a lot flowering we'll see what I get out of it spaghetti squash is something that no matter how much I get it will not be too much for us so this is my first year gardening uh, I've pulled my green beans matured I got some out of them pulled them um, and replanted what you see here and so I don't know how that's gonna go but it's okay uh, it's my, my first time so anyway I hope you enjoyed my update remember like and subscribe have a blessed day